The second half of our Friday night football doubleheader brings us to a beautiful evening in Regina with the Riders and Elks set to meet for the third time this season. Gets it away cleanly. Alford steps ahead, takes it at the 26. Mario Alford with some space on the far side of the field. This could be trouble. Gets to midfield. Finally forced out at the 45. Instant field position from Mario Alford. Oh. Slightly awkward. <laughs> Riders will start on the ground. Jamal Morrill finds some space all the way up. Still going. First down, Riders. Nice start to the game for Jamal Morrill. Open the scoring. 26 yarder just inside the left hash. And he's able to knock it through. Riders on top here early. Hamilton wins two. That's over. Second and seven. Four man rush. Ford. Takes off again, trying to find some space. He's got a first down this time. Midfield and steps out at the Ryder 50. First big play of the game for the Edmonton quarterback. One against the Riders. Second and four. Dola Gala with time. Deep shot down the field. Almost hauled in. And then it picked off the other way. Bouncing into the hands of Lewis. His fourth interception of the season. Holy smokes, looked like Emelis might have it. And he puts it right back into the arms of Marcus Lewis. The Edmonton 36. Ford dumps it off. Brown waiting for it, and that is intercepted the other way. Revis gets it. Once again, a fortunate bounce. And he's right there to take it away. Some wild times at Mosaic. The health of Jamal Morrill. Second and six. Dola Gala towards the end zone. Touchdown, Riders! Into the hands of Sean Bain. His third strike of the season. And Saskatchewan goes up by nine. On a beautiful night, 16 degrees at kickoff here in Regina. Ford wide open. Former rider Kyron Moore up to midfield, just shy of the Saskatchewan 50 before he is tracked down. We'd like to welcome everybody joining us after a thrilling finish between the Argos and Alouettes. Riders leading here by 10. Kevin Brown trying to change that all the way down to the 30, still going Brown to the 20 before he is taken down. And a big play by Kevin Brown as he picks up where he left off last week. Riders had a pretty good pushback last time. Now Cornelius oh. wants to throw it to the end zone! Touchdown, A.C. Leonard! Flag on the play, but Cornelius drops it in to the former rider in the secondary tonight. Second and ten. Gola Gala, far side of the field. Flag there as that ball is caught. Sidestepping on the far side is the rookie, Jarrett Stearns. Now they'll hand it off. Brought up the near side, heavy collision, and eventually a late push at the wow, end of the play. Schaefer Baker gets bumped. Is that McLaurin again? 85.7% coming into the game. Has one already, and you can give him two as he strokes that one through. And the Riders go on top, 13 to 7. Midway through the second quarter, thank you very much for joining us for the second half of our Friday night football coverage. Here's Ford, delayed draw. Brown bounces off a tackle, he's got a first down, and Kevin Brown right to midfield. That'll put him over 60 yards rushing here in the first quarter and a half. Only one game in his entire career without a catch. Ford down the field, over the middle to his running back. Brown, no, oh, broken up. Nice play defensively by Washington, I believe, yes. How about Kevin Brown down the field? Comes up with a bit of a limp, and now he'll head off to the sideline. Already this season as well. Ford. Over the middle again. A completion again as this time he finds Eugene Lewis for the first time today, and Edmonton picks up another first down. This one just 16 yards inside the left pass. No problem. That mistake. Lother from 56. It is up and it is short. Taken by Sims, CJ Sims, all the way back to the 20 before he is tripped up. That was a deep, deep shot from Lother. 56 comes up just shy. 
first is field. And look who this is. We were told that Brown was out of the game, and now he's back in. Picks up a first down. Multiple flags, I think, for a horse collar. Yeah, it'll be horse collar at the end of that. It'll be tack on another 15. Just inside the left hash to tie this game at 13. Riders led this game 10 0. Finds Emelis on the near sideline over midfield. And the fourth catch of the ball game for Emelis is his longest thus far, which is now down to the Edmonton 26. Nice window, finds a man, touchdown Riders! Tevin Jones and Dola Gala finishes off an excellent drive. Saskatchewan goes back on top. Edmonton down by seven again. Ford escapes on the run to his right, will take off this time, still going. And he's got a little bit of space for a first down. Trey Ford, a little bit of extra burst along the far sideline. First and ten. Ford gets it away just in time. Brown again trying to kick it to the outside. Can he find some space on the far side of the field? Yes. Down to the 20 to the 10. Kevin Brown is gone. Touchdown Edmonton. Another big one from Brown. And the Elks are back within one. Pipkin into the game. And they'll try to stretch him out. Now he's going to throw. He's got a man wide open. Are you kidding me? Drops it in there at the 45. Down to the 40. Still going. Jamal Morrow stays on his feet. Hold down just shy of the 10. Oh boy, an all timer there into the hands of Jamal Morrow. Edmonton, will they bring pressure again? They do. Dola Gala gets it away quickly. Has a completion and a touchdown all the way to the end zone. Second of the game for Sean Bain, and the Riders go back on top. Fans are loving it. Here's Brown, Kevin Brown, what a night he's having. Takes it inside the 30, down to the 25. Little spin move at the end of the play due to injury. Second and 17, Ford in trouble, spins to his left, stays on his feet. Now Ford with time, looking down the field, throwing to the end zone, touchdown! Geno Lewis, some magic from the fabulous Ford, and he drops it into Lewis and the Elks answer back. Absolutely, and really, really happy for him. Well deserved. Ford looking for a big shot down the field to Lewis, goes up and gets it. Brilliant stuff by Geno Lewis. Never in doubt, was it? Edmonton has not led in this ball game. Ford. In trouble on the run, right up the middle, touchdown! Trey Ford takes it home for Edmonton, and they go on top. There is a flag on the near side. Illegal contact on the receiver, Saskatchewan number 28. That penalty is declined, it's a touchdown. Trying to keep those slim hopes alive, Dola Gala in his own end zone. He's in trouble, will be taken down by the Edmonton defense. Did he get out is the question, or did he get, or is he in the end zone? Was he tackled in the end zone? So he doesn't get out, it's a safety. Upon automatic review, the ruling on the field is overturned. It's a safety touch that's been scored by Edmonton. Wow. For Saskatchewan after the beatdown in the Banjo Bowl and dropping one here at home, but Trey Ford gets the job done. His running back, Kevin Brown, leading the way in this one, though. 175 yards on the ground for Kevin Brown. Nobody in the league has ran the ball better than Kevin Brown ran it tonight for Edmonton.